everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do my very first cash stuffing video and I'm super excited but I'm also super nervous. I started budgeting my salary into categories um September of this year but this is the first time I've actually had cash on hand. I'll be honest, it was embarrassing getting this much cash from the ATM. I somehow forgot that ATMs only dispense by 100s and tried to get 20s and 50s out of the machine. After I withdrew the first 20,000, it told me I reached my withdrawal limit for the day and I know from experience you can increase that using the mobile app so I tried and of course I couldn't log in because of the internet connection. I started to step away from the machine but then I was able to log in so I stepped back and bumped into the next guy in line who was ready to replace me. I apologized but it was embarrassing and by the time I was done with my withdrawals, a long line had built up. Thankfully, it was just one line for two machines otherwise I think I would have gotten some choice words from those behind me. Anyway, now that everything is arranged, let's get on with the cash stuffing. Today we are stuffing 57,700 pesos which is my monthly salary, so bi-weekly that's 28,850 pesos, but I only get paid once a month at the end of each month. Here is my DIY budget binder and if you have any questions regarding my categories, feel free to ask them in the comments or watch my budget categories introduction video which I'll link in the description. Okay, so first category, condominium unit. We are stuffing 12,800 pesos, which is the minimum amount I have to stuff in this envelope. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12,000. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 800. I thought that for this month, I might have to stuff this with more cash because we went to the condo for turnover last October 29 and I thought I'll need more money for condo juice and furnishings but we found damages on the unit so it's not ready for turnover yet. So for this month, we're only stuffing 12,800 pesos. For our next category, PLDT will be getting 1,950 pesos. So that's 1,000 and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 950. Our PLDT bill is 1,948 pesos and 99 cents per month. But this month, I called to cancel our call all service bundle add-on. So I'm expecting a lower PLDT bill starting next month. Yes, we'll get the usual 2,000 pesos. My fiancé and I are planning to do oculars for our reception venue this month. So I did ask him if he wants me to contribute more towards our guests. But he told me it's okay and that he trusts me to help out with our other date-related expenses if our fuel consumption turns out to be really high. So this envelope is only getting 1, 2,000 pesos. Dating, I usually budget 3,000 for date spending but this month I'm putting in 4,000 pesos because as I've mentioned, we're planning to go out a lot this month to do oculars. So that's 1, 2, 3, and 4,000 pesos. My personal allowance is going to get 2,000 pesos. I don't know what I'm buying yet besides my food deliveries. I'm thinking of starting a new cross-stitch project but I really want to focus on YouTube as well. I'll let you know in the next cash stuffing video if I bought one or not. Side hustle will get its usual 2,000 pesos. I don't know yet what I'm spending this on, but it's there if I need it. Gifts will get 2,000 pesos. It's my nephew's birthday at the end of this month, and he's such a big help to me personally and around the house. These labels were actually printed by him, so I'm going to give him 1,000 for his birthday. And then I'm keeping another thousand in case I'm invited to any party because the month of love was nine months ago and there are a lot of November babies. And finally, for personal goal, I'll be allocating 1,000 pesos. This month, my goal is to lose some weight, so I might use this cash to buy some exercise equipment. But again, I'll let you know in the next cash stuffing video if that changes. 
Wedding fund will get 20,000 pesos. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20,000. So far, I have a total of 60,000 pesos in this sinking fund. So if we do find our reception venue this month, then we're at least ready with the reservation fee. Christmas fund will get 4,000 pesos. 1, 2, 3, 4,000 pesos. I have a total of 12,000 pesos for the sinking fund. Ready, ready now to be spent on Christmas shopping. MP2 will get 5,000. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5,000 pesos. Once I've deposited this, I will have a total of 15,000 pesos on this MP2 account. And then finally, Buffer Fund will get the remaining 950 pesos. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 950 pesos. And that is all our money stuff. As I've mentioned, I only get paid once a month, so the next cash stuffing will be on December. But I do have other videos you guys can check out in the meantime. I hope you enjoy them. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!